Hey guys, sorry we didn't realize that for most of my video that my boyfriend's face decided to just, you know, be cut off. But we hope you still enjoy this video. Thank you guys. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry it's been so long. We moved to Michigan. Woo! It's been crazy but fun. I love it here. Yeah, it's crazy. It's a five hour drive away from home and the past two months have been just setting up everything and just getting everything ready and making sure that we're in a good position. So it's been a while and hi, I'm back. Um, here we're doing, well, I guess you can say it. <laughs> we're going to do a snack crate again today. It's from Poland, which just happens to be his home country. So this should be exciting. Yeah. So I know basically everything in this crate. Um, I've either had it once before in my life, seen it or had it on a daily basis. Yeah. I was born in Poland and moved here to America when I was three. Not that we looked at the cranes. We just opened it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay. So first Good. things first, we're gonna open it up. And it comes with this, oh, let me grab this. Comes with this nice little pamphlet. You got some stuff. I don't know how the focus is gonna be there, but you got fun facts. You got everything that's gonna come inside and just a couple of other things that may come with it. Are there stickers? There, there's stickers. Are there? No. Sometimes there is. I don't see any stickers. No, no stickers in this one. Okay, so we're just gonna do the top one first. first. So it's chips. Okay, so uh, another fact about me, I'm Polish, but I dropped out of Polish school in third grade. So I can't read or write, but I'm gonna try. I'll say wapse, I think. Wapse? Snaki? Smaku, Serov. So it's basically, huh, it's a uh, onion and cheese chips. That's what they are. Just think of it as Lay's, but like onion, flavor? onion and cheese flavor. I don't actually think I've ever had these. I've had a form of these. These are nice because they kind of disintegrate in your mouth pretty quickly. Oh, they smell like, like onions, kind of. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They do kind of disintegrate in your mouth. It's a really, it's a soft chip that, yeah, it kind of like melts in your mouth a little bit. It's not like, you know, American chips where they crunch and crunch. It will like, once the saliva hits it, it just kind of melts down. And it's just like a soft chip to eat. That's good. It's really good. I actually like these a lot. Mm. Yeah, I'll just I'll show it off one more time. I don't know if you guys can see. Oh, I like these. Oh, okay. Oh, so, but it's bacon. Yeah, so these are these are bacon flavored bacon, bacon flavored pretzels. I get my mom buys these at home all the time, like a Polish local Polish market. Really? Um, Osmaku. Polaski. No. I don't know that word, but whatever. It's just saying like the flavors. Bacon. Bacon. Um, bacon. Bacon. I think, I don't know. If you're Polish and you're watching this and you're more <laughs> Polish than I am, don't judge me. I dropped out in third grade. Basically, yeah, the only Polish I spoke was at home and with family. So go ahead and open that up. Polish. But I love these. These I already know what they're gonna taste like and they're fantastic. Even the bacon ones, you got the bacon ones? I just said my mom used to buy these all the time. Probably still does. I thought there were different ones in the jar. Those were normal ones. Mm -hmm. These were hidden in the closet. It legitimately tastes like bacon bits. It's bacon bits. Very salty though. Mm -hmm. That's why I never really ate them a lot, but... I don't like them. No? Mm -hmm. I... It's very bacony. These I love. I feel like if you like crunched it up on top of your salad, it would actually be pretty good. But kind of like um, what are those things called in salad? The little square croutons. Croutons. Hmm. Replace the crouton. Yeah, it says it's aha. An, it's an aha. <laughs> the best way to describe this. <clears throat> yeah, listen, I I'm, I'm not gonna even try to read these. To be hundred percent honest, oh you have what, two, sweet. Aha. Aha! Um, what's, a, <laughs> yeah, what's the best way? I don't even know how I would describe these. There is an American candy that is... Sesame 
is very similar That's to it. That's not what I was expecting. Um, I'd say it's basically like seeds covered in honey. I'd say that that'd be the best way to... I, 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 I'm not going to try to read the ingredients. I'm really not. I love these things, though. They're very... They're very hard. Very hard. But goddamn, are they good. I like them. I feel like this would be a snack for Penelope. That would be. Birds would, yeah, a bird would love this. Just take the whole thing. They're delicious. Put this aside here. Oh, that's really chewy. Mine is chewy. After a while, it is a little chewy. It's the seeds. You know how like you eat sunflower seeds and it's chewy over time? It's very bland. What? I think otherwise. I think there's a lot of flavor in that. <laughs> At least I think it's coated with honey. I have no idea. It kind idea. of tastes like honey, yeah. Right? Like a little bit of like honey sugar. Mm -hmm. It's very sugary. It's, 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 not a, it's not a healthy snack, that's for sure. I think it's healthy. It's like honey and seeds. Honey yeah. is healthy. No, I'm not saying it's not, but I'm saying it's like covered in sugar. Alright, what's next? I'm going to take another one. I really want to try the drink. Okay. So. Go ahead. Just read it. It's exact. So the thing about the Polish language or is. Zada. Close. So the thing about the Polish language is what you read is what you basically say. There's a couple of letters. Am I supposed to shake that, it first? No, no, this is soda. Oh. So it's pronounced Orenjada. Orenjada. So I don't know if you guys can see this logo here. But. There, that Z with a little apostrophe on top, it makes it have a different sound. My last name, for example, I'm not going to say it, but there's an O in my last name with an apostrophe on top. So it doesn't sound like an O, it sounds like a U. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So, yeah, it's basically just a soda. I love this as a kid. If you go to, a cute little martini glass on <laughs> If you go to any Polish local deli or store, you can find these in bottles for 99 cents. Ooh, it's yeah, I love it. Ooh, it smells really good. So there's there's different flavors. There's a red one and a, like a normal like lime one, I'd say. I don't know. I don't know if I like it. The first taste is really good, and then the after see, it's like, whoa. Well, I'd have to taste it to see which one that is. I think that's cherry. Yeah, so it's better refrigerated. This wasn't refrigerated. I'd say it's definitely better refrigerated. This is the normal one. This is kind of like the... The clear one, if you go to any market, there's the clear one and there's the red one. I kind of like it. It tastes like like a healthy soda. It does. It tastes healthy. It tastes like carbonated water almost. So I'll just show that off again. It's not as, I wouldn't say it's carbonated water. It's got flavor to it. Right, but that's what it kind of tastes like. Yeah. Kind of. Put that over here. Okay, what's next? It's a heart. So it is a heart. Actually, this, if, if, I've had something like this before. Yeah, so it's a Kropnik. Remember that thing we had at my sister's? I think so. Okay, so it's a Kropnik. That's the best way I'm going to pronounce it. Um, I'm not going to try to read that, but whatever. <laughs> if you're Polish, you know what it says. Um, that's not my field right there. Uh, these I do like. They're very... Tarpy. I, I mean, honestly, tarp? that's... So, like... You mean tarp? No. What's a... A tarp is, like, a... No, no, okay. I don't even know how to... Uh, just, you'll you'll see. It's very dry. It's very dry. Oh, it's like... Like gingerbread. It's Yeah, it's kind of like gingerbread. It's it very smells dry. smells exactly like gingerbread. Yeah, it does. Is that what it is? It's just gingerbread? Maybe. I'm, I don't know. I'm too stupid to know. Stupid. Very dry, though. Not something I'd personally snack on a lot. There are ones... It's better than gingerbread. I love this. Yeah? Mm -hmm. There are ones that have filling in them. Mm. So little hearts that have, like, kind of jelly in them. Those I want a like thousand more. of these. And the outer coating, what would that be? What would you say that is? That's like a... It's like a hard sugar. Hard sugar, kind of like a, like a Krispy Kreme donut? Yeah, like a glaze. Yeah, it's a glaze. Yeah, that's the word I was thinking of. I just couldn't say it. Mm. I like them. 
They're good. Not something I'd snack on constantly, but. I mean, it says coffee. I don't know, it doesn't. Oh, it's, a, it's a waffle. It's a waffle. It's basically a waffle. It's not, though. <laughs> um, it's, what's the word? Um, a rice, rice thing? Oh, rice cake. Right, yeah, I'd say the, the closest thing is like a rice cake with chocolate on top. I don't know. So it makes a healthy snack unhealthy. Yeah. <laughs> I you don't know how to say that one. Look, listen, if you're... Oh, it says right here, rice cakes with... Uh, <laughs> so it is. It's a rice cake with... with Belgian chocolate. Belgian milk chocolate. That's what I'm going Do you want more of this? Yeah. Um, listen, if you're Polish and you're watching this, you can... In the comment down below how much you hate the fact that... I guess. <laughs> that I'm, I'm terrible at my own native language. Mm. These are good. I don't think I've had these too much, but... The Belgian chocolate smells good. It does. Not something... I think it's too dry for me. Mm. I'm not into dry snacks like this. Chocolate makes up for it a little bit, though. Because mm. you got literally half and half. That's good. But, yeah. It's good. It's delicious. Not something I'd eat all the time, though. I would. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ooh, chocolate. Which one? I you? can't pronounce that. <laughs> I'm not. Chocolata? Mm -hmm. Chocolata. See, I know that because I'm Czech. <laughs> this one, I haven't. It's not a company. It's not a company. It's not branded that I know of. Gianna? I don't know. Jadiana? I don't know, but that's it right there. I think it's white chocolate, if I'm not mistaken. Mm. No, it's not. It's black, dark chocolate. Black, whatever. Dark chocolate. <laughs> it is. I mean, it's just... I'm not going to have this. I, you have to try a little bit. No, I absolutely hate dark chocolate. Ooh, it came out nicely. It, I, I will not eat it. But you can have mm. it. Mm. So, yeah. That's that. You can give your review on that. Well, excuse me, jeez. That's the best. That's the best. Mm. I'm not. I'm not. Stitch in the back, though. Oh, okay. Good? Mm -hmm. It's thick, right? It's a very thick, rich chocolate. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But, like, I really like it because when you bite into it, it makes that the crunch to them. Mm. So it's like, it's real chocolate. Yeah. It's real chocolate. I'm gonna have another one of these. Mm -hmm. These are delicious. What's next? You, I'm sure. <clears throat> Principolo. Principolo. Many of you have seen this. This is a fa very famous Polish chocolate. It's um, it's wafer chocolate basically. You, I think you've had this. I think so. Yeah. So there's actually different types. Do you wanna take out the other ones? There should be, uh, it'll say Princessa. There's two types. It's in there, I saw it. I mean, no, I didn't. Yep, that's it. So it's Prince El Polo, Princessa. Now, I think this is the white chocolate version of it. The inside. Okay, there are white chocolate versions of these, which are fantastic. Um, so yeah, that's, that's that. Um, this I've had a million times in my life, so I'll just let you have a bite of that one. I don't think I've actually had this, like, half and half one, so I'm gonna try it out. And then I'll hand it over to you. Yeah, this one I've never had. Hmm. It's just wafer chocolate, chocolatey wafers. Mmm, okay. Wow. That's good. That's fantastic. I don't. I've had it before. I can eat these all day. These are fantastic. They go for like, if you go to like a Polish deli around you or a Polish store, right? Right? Um, I like that one better. Really? Mm -hmm. I like that one. Um, they're probably like 80 cents each, maybe less. If you live in America. If you're watching this from Poland. I don't know how much they go for in Poland. 
I've never had this. Oh, that's coconut. Mm -mm, that's all you. Cocos. I, I you know what? I'm sorry. I wish I was more Polish than I am. Out of all the days in the year, today would be a good day to learn and read Polish. I'll try it, but you can have a nibble. I like coconut. Mm -hmm. Looks good. Looks like poop. I it definitely it, it kind of does look like a little turd, but it definitely don't smell it. It's it's all coconut. <sighs> you got something right here. Mmm. Mmm. You actually might like this. It's not as much as you think. You got some too. I got. I'm, it's very, very soft. It's all coconut. It's very soft. Um, I can't tell if that's like a caramel layer on top. It looks like that. A little bit of caramel. Now you got some over here. A little caramel layer on top, I'd say. All coconut. I love it. Delicious. Mmm. What's next? Uh, I you have a water. Teeth. Yeah. Oh, so it's the same thing, but with hazelnut? Let me see. Yeah. Looks like it. So this is the classic. Original. How to get my face out of there. I don't, I gotta figure out how to pronounce these names. stickers. There were? Now there are stickers. Put it on my forehead. Put it on my forehead. I'll put one on your forehead. Give me a second. Yeah, so it's just a classic. Open that up. Which one? Is that a little one? No, I'm gonna do the pulling snack right. <laughs> That's how you know you have a big forehead. When you can fit a whole sticker on it. Is this the last thing? Mm-mm. No? No, there's these like okay, well, fillers. Yeah, yeah, we'll do it. This one I gotta try though. It's tough. Uh, it's tough because all that coconuts in my mouth right now. Mm, okay, they hit in. I like it. Yeah, that's really good. Mm. There's like more caramel on this one, but it's yeah, good. very caramel. So I'd say it's like a a layer of like what like cookie dough type thing on the bottom. Yeah. You know. Kind of like a Twix. It's basically a Twix with hazelnut. That's a good. That's that's the best way to put it. Yeah. A United, you know, if you live in the United States, it's a Twix. Oh yes. Ooh. Don't I almost lost the box. Yeah, I'll just put it on the floor. Yeah. Candy. <clears throat> so that's it. Gummy candy. So hold on, I'll show these off. So it's, it's just fresh fruities. These are just basically like fruity gummies. Um, what would be the best way to like reference them to American ones? Fruit gummies. We have those. Fruit gummies with like sugary coating. These are amazing. Right, let me show the box because you freaking, you tore off the name. Zuzo. 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 Something like that. And you can apparently win a free PS4. So yeah, um, this candy brand with this character specifically is very well known in Poland. Um, they have these really cool like... Um, Coca-Cola gummies and like Coca-Cola candy and like certain flavored candies and stuff and like they mm. I just remember being a kid and eating Coca-Cola candy and it was all zoos out of those out or whatever it might if somebody in my family watches this they're gonna be mad at me because they're gonna be like How do you not know how to pronounce any of these names? It's so good. Is it? So it's like a little rainbowy. It's what's what are what's the American version of these? They're just called Rainbow. They're like the same What's thing. the name of them, though? Mm -hmm. There's a name to these things. Um, Airhead, uh... Airheads. No, it's Airhead Rainbow something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Really good. Last but not least. I'm gonna eat all of those later. Last but not least, these things. Well, fruity gummies. So there's a lime, oranges, raspberries, lemons, pineapple. and pineapple. Mm -hmm. 
I think that's what's in that one. Wait, no. Oh, no, you have a different one, right? So I think I have... I don't know. I don't, you know what? I don't know. I'm just going to take a bite and switch. Do I half and half? Tough packaging. Oh, it's got a little, like, filling inside. You can't see it. But with the yellow one, you can see... Maybe get my face out of it. There's a little filling inside. It's all sugar. So if you have sensitive teeth, careful. Oh, yours didn't have a filling. Mine does. If you ever had those Starburst gummies with the fillings inside, it's like that covered in sugar. You can literally see. Very sugary. It's literally covered in sugar, though. This one is the pineapple one. That one's good. I like that one. Mm. It's just... Well, okay. That's basically it, right? Do you have the little paper bars? Let me get this out of the way. Mm -hmm. Snack crate. Not sponsored. We are not sponsored. But hey, Snack crate, if you're watching this, sponsor her. Her channel. Okay, so we'll do. What do you, you want to do? Okay, we'll do. We'll do a little fun facts. A couple of fun facts about Poland. The name Poland or originates from the tribe Polanie, which means people living in open fields. Fun. Oh, wow. Fun. So fun. Fun fact number two. Poles eat pizza with ketchup. That is true. A lot of Polish people do like ketchup. We eat. You don't like ketchup. I don't. I'm more Americanized. I love ketchup. But on pizza? Maybe. Americans usually do like what, ranch and stuff? Yeah. Yeah. I would okay. try it. Fun fact number three. Poland is one of the few countries in the world where... Help me, I'm stupid. Courteous. Courteous hand kissing is still a common practice. Yes, that is very true. Very true. That is very true. His whole family does that. Mm-hmm. Cool. Google. Hi. Um, Poland has more than 17 Nobel Prize... <clears throat> I, help me out here. Laureates. Laureates. I don't know what that means. Do you? I don't know. Um, of these four, uh, for Peace Prize and five in literature. Interesting. I'd say Poland, educationally wise, edu that made sense. Educationally. educationally. <laughs> um, they're pretty high up there. They have some good schools and stuff. Yeah. And last but not least, the most, yeah, the world's strongest man uh, winners are from Poland. So the world's strongest man... I What's his name? Oh, my dad would kill me. I talk to it about about it all the time. He, um, I don't think he's the world's strongest man anymore. But in the past like ten years or so, he he's been the one setting the records, um, and he's Polish. Fun fact. So yeah, I'm not gonna. We're not gonna read this whole thing, are we? No. no. But that's it. That's snack wise. Yeah. You got you got your chips, your wafer chocolates. Your honey honey covered peanuts or seeds. <laughs> um, you got your soda. Yeah. Okay, so out of everything, what was your favorite? My favorite? Oh, God. I mean, I pff, that's tough. I used to eat these things all the time. You have to pick a favorite. Okay. Give me a second. Mine's this one. Krotnik? Mm -hmm. I really like the gingerbread. Yeah. Um, I'd say the chips. Those are really delicious. Now, what this box is actually missing... Mm -hmm. I don't know if this originates from Poland. It might be actually from Czech Republic. However, I'm pretty sure it's Polish. It's called Hauwa, and you've never had it. I see it all the time. If you're Polish and watching this, or European, or anything like that, Slavic, you, if you know what Hauwa is, you know what I'm talking about. It's fantastic. Um, yeah, it's not in this crate, and I'm very disappointed. But what whatever. is that? I don't even know. I, I can't. I don't know how to describe it. Don't ask. I, I'll buy it one day and I'll show you. But okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you guys. For What's your favorite? I just said it was this oh. one. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> thank you guys so much for watching. Interrupted me and everything. Okay. <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. Welcome back to my channel. I'm sorry I was gone for so long. I'm gonna try not to be gone for that long again. Okay. Leave a like. Comment, subscribe. 
if you recommend want, some stuff down in the comments. Yeah, if you guys have any ideas you want me to do in the future, please comment let me know. Below. If you guys want to see more of my face, you know what to do. <laughs> okay, have fun, you guys. Peace out. Peace. Bye. <laughs>